Welcome oh, back, God. everyone, <laughs> for the last part of our night. You should ask Rachel. Rachel would love to. I am just so, <clears throat> They've been void jumping to Crid. Yep. And um, in their last jump, they have found a random planet in their way. Is it Mars? No, it is not Mars. <laughs> Damn it. It doesn't attack. Wait a minute. Is it Neo Earth? Is it the anime planet? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's just. Uh, it's, Romulus. it's Romulus. We found him. Oh, shit. That'd be even worse. <laughs> That'd be horrible. <laughs> <laughs> cloaking... Okay, side mission we're stealing a Romulan cloaking device. <laughs> <laughs> they have that before space travel? <laughs> oh my god. We did so sidetracked. Sorry, guys. Sorry. This is my fault. We're, we're being um, nerds. Sorry. All right. I check the sensors. I, I look up and goes, Sensor's active. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, sensors actually detect shit. Yeah, they don't give you life form readings or anything. We'd have to upgrade them. Captain, <laughs> sensors are picking up nothing. <laughs> um, my uh, frequency. <laughs> what, um, what's the planet right. look like? Is it like it, it, it looks like it has a lot of vegetation? Okay, so it is a green world. It's Endor. That yeah. doesn't make it. It doesn't make it oxygen. It make it oxygen. <laughs> so um, I would recommend that Rekier, me, and Banner go because all our suits are like are are. Um, as long as like, as long as yeah. we can tell the temperature, the temperature is the only thing I have to worry about. I don't have to worry about that. I have yeah. a life suit. Like uh, for space, life suit. Yeah, I think I. Oh, well, we have we had the life suits too. If you we guys have want life suits, yes. I can't yeah. use magic in them though. So uh, I looked up life suits. I don't think they count as armor though. They That's are the base light suits. They're under a gear. Are they? Because the ones the armored vac suits we had were armor. I thought we just had uh, basic life suits, and you were looking up those. There's like life suit, which is two hundred under armor, and it's. Uh, a one piece jumpsuit comes equipped with a glass oh, dome. Yeah, helmet. Life suit. Yeah, life suit is not armor. It's yeah. under gear. Oh, because yeah. I, I don't know. know. It has yeah. I think you were looking up the like armor version of it, not the equipment version of it. And we have the environs. The... Yeah, the ones you found before originally were armored. Okay. Yeah, so the one, yeah, the one I was using was armored. I know that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I thought we found a bunch of like one armor. Yeah, one you armor. have some basic life suits yeah. as well. Yeah. Okay. So I say, do we all go? Like that seems weird to leave all of us sleeping. We I don't mean, have an have... AI to manage a ship. If someone comes along, it's a derelict ship to them. I mean, I can stay here. I have the arcane can. No, no, I'll we could blow use somebody you. Up. If someone gets hurt, we that's... could use you. That's true. I can heal people. Um, My so only say, point in this campaign is landing and being in a dogfighter, so don't make me stay. <laughs> <laughs> so I think Rekir should stay. <laughs> he I, lands I, I the whole ship. He I lands the whole ship. Like, no, fuck y'all. <laughs> I'm going down. I'm gonna try to blast you guys out of the sky. <laughs> oh look, now I'm all alone. <laughs> uh, I'm sure. Re I'm sure Remy will survive. He has a suit. <laughs> so, are you taking the shuttle down? Yeah, we have to. We don't teleport I mean, yet. We could technically take both, but engage. The shuttle has to be one of them. Yeah, I mean, the gear can go down, too. Yeah, but, like, there's too many of us to go on just the gear. We have to do Yeah, the true. All right, so pilot check. Yep, give me a pilot check. Pilot. Dirt. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. Well, no, I mean, good. it's above a 10 and yeah. a 12. Don't you have that? Don't you have the feet? Though? Can't you yeah, don't you have some kind of super piloting feet? Mm, I pretty um, much, I have that what it would give me anyway. Is there any reason not to take the shuttle and the cog? You'd have to yeah. make two separate checks. Yeah, just be taking extra checks. As Tiv goes over to roll as piloting. I, I honestly <laughs> hope you don't crash the cog. I don't want to hope you don't crash the cog. Because you're like, I just want to do it. Hmm. Okay. Look at that. I did better than the pilot. <laughs> With his plus 10. You both have a little bit of a rough landing. No damage or anything, but the 
the ground here is very wet and you kind of sink in a little. Oh, please don't X-Wing us. <clears throat> no, we need, two more, we, need, we need two more levels before I, we can do that. Anyways, we're on the planet now. Both ships have landed. All right, I will exit first since I have a life suit on. And um, Banner can too, if he wants. Sure. I'm, I'm in my own ship, so. Yeah, we can't talk to you. You have communication devices. No, no, we don't. Fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> I can't talk to you. You have. They're, they're having a brotherly device. dispute right now. That's why he took his own he, shit. He didn't want to come with me. <laughs> you didn't come with me. There's room for one more. Was it? I didn't know. Yeah. That. I think it's fire. Uh, cap. But Cinder was over pilot. here. She smells like sweet rolls. I think she still has a pellet on her. <laughs> what do you like a dog or something? <laughs> you smell the food in my pocket? I'm not the one well, the cat's the food us, in your pocket. All right? <laughs> um all right. So I just let me go out first, Banner, just in case the temperature's bad. All right. Sounds fine. Uh, since I have a life. So Rimby's suit is like literally think Iron Man. Because I am a small creature, I can literally have a mech suit that makes me a medium-sized creature. Yeah. Well, let's look <laughs> up the Iron Man theme from Ozzy. <laughs> um, <laughs> it seems like it's a perfectly lush world. All right. Temperature seems fine and everything? Yeah. All right. I'll inform them that they can come out. Is it got breathable oxygen? Yes. Oh. Does it have breathable? Okay. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes, it does. Okay. In the Star Trek universe, it'd be an M class planet. Ooh, fancy. So fancy. Okay. <laughs> Dex is the ship, I guess. You know, what are we here for now? If this is an uninhabited planet, this might be actually a good place to know about. We could make some kind of base of operations here on a planet towards the center of the map, the galaxy. And it would be I dub awesome. the Rimbus. <laughs> <laughs> That's all you have to do to declare a name, right? I need a flag. You need a flag. Uh, actually, uh, I don't. Oh. <laughs> so, can we fly around and look? I mean, I, I still have my lance. Will that work? Pretty for sure I can make a flag real quick. <laughs> <laughs> we should make sure it's uninhabited. Yeah, we should fly around. That we can cover more distance if, on the ship. What if we find like the home world of the roaches? Roaches. We'll be rich, them. and yeah. the cat will OD. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's okay I because in like twenty years, we're all evil CEO owners uh, and vying for each other. There's like three different, uh, six different corporations on this planet. We're all against each other. <laughs> So you, next you time, you could do some low, low atmosphere flying to scout out around. You could scout out on foot. Well, completely up to you, people. I'm sure the planet is of a decent size, so perhaps on foot is uh, not necessarily a good idea. No. Um, at the first place that we were at on foot, I'm going to use my Omni tool. Uh, That's a the scanner. Text. The scanner, as in, it takes an action, so you can only do one of them. But, uh, so I'll pull up my arm and I'll scan the area to see if there's any electromagnetic uh, spectrum, any type of signals being sent from anything besides our ship. No. Okay, we go back, I go back in and go, no, there's nothing <laughs> on here. <laughs> no, um, you do the Rimby voice. Well, there's oh no God. signals being sent from the planet. Um, yes, um, I do not sense any um electrical signals on this planet we might uh, we should we should probably pilot around and see maybe we can have um wreck here go the opposite direction uh that we do so we can cover twice the ground i would suggest we stay together in case there's an anti-air which would shoot you guys out of the sky before i could cover you yeah the transport doesn't have any weapons and you have your tool could be use your tool that used on the ground to at least give like basic scans or basic information more than just visual no 
This only works in a very small range, only 30 feet. Wow. Would be flying higher than the scan range. Does um, the shuttle have any kind of sensors or anything like that on it? I mean, yes, <laughs> but... <laughs> it's base sensor stuff. It can see objects, stuff like that, but nothing, nothing to... Nothing that's going to give you deep scans. Well, I'm just curious of, like, buildings, signs of intelligent life, that thing, to scan for that. It, it, it can tell you structures on the ground. That's about it. Why don't we scan for structures? Just see if there's anything around. We'll go over it. We'll take a visual look, too. Um, Agreed. See what we see. Agreed. Activate jump. <laughs> you don't have jump engines. <laughs> Then what did I just press? A random I... button. <laughs> um, all right, the windshield cool. wipers. A pe- no, a pellet pops out of the replicator. Oh. Uh, oh, it's wood. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> that, you didn't reprogram the shuttles, one. It's only wood on the shuttle. <laughs> anyway. Gonna, gonna have to fix that shit. <laughs> So we're going to um, fly around and look for yeah. stuff. Everyone, um, pilots of the two ships, give me perceptions. I hope our pilot is perceptive. Oh, wait, are we flying around on the surface? Tell yes. me, can I stand outside on the bo- on the sh- on top of it with my magnet boots <laughs> as he's flying around? And just so I can so I can keep an eye out? Just don't, I mean, you could go to space. It would. It's okay. Just don't re-enter orbit with me up there. <laughs> that might be bad. Can I do a perception check if I'm outside? No, I'm not going to be outside. <laughs> okay, and also give me both pilot checks. Come on, Swift. Show them up. Show them up, I Swift. Get that nat 20. <laughs> get that. Get that. You can do it. I mean... He just has it's to roll. Being delayed for some oh, no! <laughs> yeah. So, nice. The record's flying, and Swift is flying around him the whole time. Oh, oh no, Swift. Oh. <laughs> Why, why'd you do it twice? Because it, there was a lag in the first one, yeah. Um, uh, you got worse. <laughs> I, I, I'm, considering the, I'm considering the, the first one anyway, so. Um, but... Wreck here. You think you notice some um, built some dilapidated buildings up ahead? Boop. Hey, Swift, stop being a dumbass and flying around me. There's buildings <laughs> up ahead. I know. I'm already on the fifth floor of one of them. <laughs> Land <Blamed> it. it. <laughs> I see it, bitch. <laughs> Uh, and they're also uh, dilapidated. Do you take a place to land? Yeah, you can find a place to land um, that's relatively clear. Like an old parking lot. So if you're making me nauseous. What type of buildings are these? <laughs> do these look like, uh, like what level? Do they look like, like our level of civilization? Something in between what we've encountered on like Concordia or Concordia? Yeah, like Tech 1, Tech 2, Tech 3. Do I know? Do I know? Four. Looking at them? I'll say like, Alice. Scan the scan the blueprints and design. Like, we what, probably how... on um, freaking uh, Zolda encountered like probably a couple of like small sky like not like skyscrapers but some pretty tall buildings. You know, like you know. Y- so we get an idea. We're just, we were just well, on you're also our Concordia, Concordia too. Yeah, Concordia, was yeah, ridiculous. A machine just, world. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so we do have like comparisons for like type of buildings. What what kind of what do these look like, Delop? I, I get tech roll. Yes, I saw. It. You would say this is in between. Okay. Yours and like um. Give us a century. Maybe Zolda. Zolda, yeah. You, is, kind of like current time. Okay. What, what is this ER? <laughs> Okay, so is there like a parking lot we can yeah. land? Well, well, not a parking lot, but you can find fa- it. it it's this a place is very overgrown. Oh, Walmart. Oh, we found space garbage. 
So we land. I get out. You guys probably do. Yeah. yeah. All right. Who's ready to go exploring? <sighs> I am ready to join you, my friend. Well, first things first. I check for any type of electromagnetic signal within no. 30 feet of me. <laughs> At no. all times until we enter the building, because it's just an action. Yep. <laughs> I really... <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna I mean, say something, but it was very know-it-all sciency, and I'm like, no, 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 I'm not gonna be a dick about that. <laughs> I'm fairly certain radio signals are omnipresent, so if you're not going to determine it once, you're probably not gonna get it next time. <laughs> no, you don't. You're not finding any technology. If there is what you're using your scanners for, Rimby, it might be long since destroyed. Yes, uh, I'm also trying to make sure we're not walking into an ambush. At least nothing that's technological. What is this? Three cans of what? Crash? Yeah. Yes. What? Energy drink. Yeah, we, yeah. Have, we have like a six pack of. It's a six pack of energy drink. Wait, there's three. Yeah. There were six of them. Who's been drinking no, the crash? Six, six packs. Yeah. Six packs. <laughs> I'm so confused. It actually fights exhausted. <laughs> Matt, got, uh, Matt got upset. He's like, who's been drinking my crash? <laughs> crash. <laughs> this is my surge. <laughs> right? I'm so confused. <laughs> it actually fights the exhausted condition. Um, <laughs> oh, can I try to, all, like, a... Use um because can I try like judge from how overgrown it is like how long maybe it's been overgrrowing like use history to like kind of judge how old this might be. Can I guesstimate? It, yeah, you can guesstimate. Are there any? <laughs> oh gosh! Whoa! Okay. Uh huh. <laughs> Definitely hundreds of years. Can I wear the hat of guys on top of my armor to make me still look like a gnome? <laughs> <laughs> like, it makes it look like a gnome again. <laughs> but like you still exist three feet above you, so if anybody like does that, oh, oh, oh. I'm a gnome acting like a robot, acting like a gnome. <laughs> are you? Are you, are you a no, no, you're a you're a gnome bot in disguise. Oh god. <laughs> um, I want everyone to give me a perception as you're getting close to the building. Just sure. like, I, I'm just gonna kill you guys. You know what? <laughs> god, my roles outside of technology are so bad. That's a 12. There you go, Swift. <laughs> That's that's uh, what Swift is around for. <laughs> Noticing but stuff. Before, before you say anything, Joe, DM here. Are there any, like, consoles or, like, data pad, anything on the walls or whatever? I, no. I can... Okay. He said it was, like, uh, like our level of technology. So think about yeah, it like yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, ATMs, maybe? Yeah. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> I mean, I just, I just have this spell I can do. It's all, you know. You just want to do this spell, don't you? I want to hit something with my guy. Um, Swift. <laughs> As you you start as you're moving, you go to step over what you thought was a piece of log, and, and then you actually something catches your eye. It actually looks like it's banner. There's a joint. It almost looks like a wooden leg. It's it's a banner. We've Not the banner. joint I jumped to. <laughs> I will uh, investigate it. <laughs> He was asking about roaches earlier. Um, <laughs> it seems like very decayed, but there's definitely something under the the, the um, this plant that's here. Um, what'd you find? So, if you look to be interested in something, something shiny. Like looks like a wooden limb. I actually start trying to pull the plant away. Prosthetic okay. or something else. <laughs> Not sure. I'll pull out my laser sword. <laughs> okay, you can start cutting away the vegetation. Um, I'll cock my fists. <laughs> give, give me a dex check to carefully cut away the stuff. I'm assuming you're not trying to hurt whatever's he found. 
Oh, um... Wouldn't that be intelligence I, for you, though? No, I guess it's attack. It's a melee attack. I can use my intelligence instead. Uh, like, yeah. He's trying to, like, carefully cut away the vegetation. Yeah, no, I was trying to make it in his favor. No. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You're able to. So I'm just, like, as he's pulling it up, anytime I see a root that's, like, stretched or lifted <laughs> a little bit, I cut it. So, like, you know, it's slowly being picked up off. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually your lightsaber. It... It's integrated too. So it like to be a body of a warforged. Hey, look at that! Well, oh, interesting. I found a banner. banner. <laughs> well, and I pulled up my data pad. Here. There were more of my race at one point in time. I oh yeah. Like... <laughs> Just what say. You it. To say? Uh, I pull out my data pad. Can I? Like skim through it. Was there anything about a like a planet like this in it? Like, can would there be a way for me to? Because remember, I I, I cataloged the information. Yeah, bunch of it banner to, information. Um, could I? Is there a way I could maybe get an idea of what it, planet it could have been on here? Um, there was rumors of a Warforge homeworld. I relate this to Banner. Like, uh, we might have found your people's homeworld. You guys I'm, didn't take the best of care. Unfortunately, of I have to say, it's a little different from me. I was the first. I do know that. I'm different from the rest. That's why I was always at Fedora's side. Is, is there any weapons left over that near this? Or anything? Tools? Can I... <gasps> um... You find a very, very rusted sword near the body. That's a strange thing to have. <clears throat> well, it looks like they were still, uh, you know, weapon technology of, you know, at least they were using swords. Kind of um, primitive by today's standards. Sindra, can you tell what killed it medically? I can try. I can roll that too. I'll, I'll take a look medically. So, well, we're together. Okay, assistant! No, he rolled yeah. it himself. Oh, man, he's like, fuck you. <laughs> if one of you want to assist the other, I will allow it. Yeah, roll, roll better. Funny. No, he's good. <laughs> don't take that away. I mean, I could roll a second one, see if I roll better. Yeah. I don't. Nope. <laughs> You're not sure. It's too decayed. Unfortunately, the body's too damaged. Um, like the the metal parts are even severely rusted. The wooden parts are rotten through. Can I extract his heart? Or it's hard. You gonna eat it to grow stronger? No. Yeah, eat it to gain his courage. <laughs> Is there something uh, special about a Warforged heart? Uh, not literally, but you know, we can, you know, talk, talk, I, I can tell you what I like, you know, what I, I'm okay. thinking, you know. What uh, are you thinking? Uh, because I was the template, I was thinking of like because like the core of a Warforged, but soul probably would have originally been one would probably have been in its core its heart like how close it is to yours or something yeah like maybe i could do something with it to try to get a sense of it maybe like if i can get Sindra's help for maybe some kind of like rather than science-based arcane maybe almost like trying um, for like something akin to a speak with dead uh, oh no can you have two sparks in your own body no <laughs> um i mean maybe i I could probably remove it from you for you. I'm just um, thinking I, that because I have tools, machinist tools, tinker tools, um, <laughs> circuitry kit. What do you again? What do we this need? is it's a bit no, morbid, I'm, and I have no idea if we could get it to work. But I'm just I'm just thinking, saying to get it out, and then you guys could do your I, magic on I it. I don't I don't even know what kind of ritual it would be. I'm just hoping that there's some way that if there's some some kind of connection of the essence left over. There might not be. This it's might be worth a... a look. We're already here. Yes. Yeah. I mean, you can try. I, um, are, I believe there are magic. Or well, uh, what I would 
would we know about oh didn't we discuss there was magic to speak with the dead before or something back in the town with all the skeletons we might have mentioned it when we were great I off. mean it's not a high level spell is it yeah, but did we talk about that when we were grave robbing? Do I know about Speak with Dead? Wait, 18? Yeah. Then... Okay. Then you know, I'm trying to do that, basically. You're thinking. Something like that. But Warforged are probably more difficult to do that with. I mean, we don't have the same kind of physiology. You say that. In a way. Let me re retrieve its core, or we just take the whole body. Maybe we're taking the whole body. We have... Once we have the AI core up and running, we might be able to find out more about it since it is for doors. Yeah, we can just take the whole thing. AI core. All right. Let's. Should we keep looking around after putting this in the ship? There might be more. We're already here. Well, as soon as you try to move the body, it disintegrates. No, it doesn't. I have a thing. No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> the wood just falls apart. Yeah, but does it though? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you, you mend a foot of it and then it falls apart again. Mend it again. And does it, it really apart. though? <laughs> Reader mending? What is that? <laughs> can, can we at least save maybe like a portion of it? I mean, it it whatever it does, Joe. I'm just giving yeah, you. Yeah, shit. It, it, it's, <laughs> yeah it, 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 it's damage from time. Yeah, not like. Oh, I can fix that, actually. Really? No. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just roll my thing here. Let me just whip this out. <laughs> but you do see a glimmer in what used to be the wooden parts. Like metal -y glimmers? <gasps> Gems. Loot it for money. <laughs> Loot the corpse! I mean, I he's not using it. I hold my boots over it. I'll, I'll, I'll kind of pause for a second, and then I'll be like, well, you did steal a hand, so. Well, and the gear. I took his pinky gear. Um, while he's doing this, I'm going to go look at into some of the buildings, see if I can figure out what the buildings were. Though at least the ones were near that's still standing. Does yeah. Banner want help with the body stuff? I'll just take what's left of the ship that we can maybe salvage something of. I don't know if there's anything... With like the you need to stop picking up garbage and putting it in our bag of holding, okay? It's not the bag of holding, it's like ship. <laughs> what's, what's there seems to be a piece of ore. I, I guess we'll take like some of the remaining metal structure, the ore piece. So just write in bits of a Warforged. But, <laughs> I put in Warforged corpse and ore separately in my, in my um, inventory. Even the metal parts kind of crumble from the rust. All right, fine. No Warforged corpse. <laughs> you don't get, there is no corpse. You're getting the ore that was in the center of it. Hey, well, let's... Why does loot. Tiv look like he's in bed, but up? There? <laughs> 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 he's, he's, like... he's in his cryopod. <laughs> I didn't know that's, that. what, that's what he looks like inside his suit. He's just like... Mm. <laughs> it's, a, it's very comfortable inside the battle armor. <laughs> Nice little blanket, a little pillow. <laughs> <laughs> and on the outside, pure death. <laughs> um, all right, can I figure out what these buildings were? Like, to realize, uh, my, my thought process is, if we're in this area, if we could find, like, a, a town hall or a library, maybe we can get some information. Maybe there's, like, tablets with shit written on it that we might be able to get some information so that we can use it for research. Like, to get a name for this planet kind of thing. You, the first building that's closest to you seems to be a home. Okay. Um, where the heart is? <clears throat> what? Yeah, where the Almost heart. where the heart is. It, it um, is very dilapidated. <clears throat> um, like, you can see pieces of glass where plants have burst through the windows. Is there damage to it? Like, oh, yeah. Holes in it and stuff? Yeah, I don't mean from, like, falling down, from, like, damage, like, explosions or something. No, there's. it just seems from over time. Okay. Um, nature has taken back. Like, you're, like, there's probably nature. remnants of structures throughout this area that 
are completely overgrown. Yeah. Um, and there's no, like, like, you know how, like, uh, in a courthouse, they'll have, like, a, a stone tablet, of, you know, saying what it is or anything like that. It's just homes. Yeah, you're finding, like, homes, you're finding pieces of things, but nothing in particular that tells you anything. It, it It's just so much has decayed. Okay. Do any so I'll head back to the group. Yeah. If you let us know, are you going to let us know about what you found? Yes, of course. Do any of the buildings have perhaps a basement? Maybe, maybe something that would have been protected from the weathering for, to a degree. A sealed off area. If there's a bunker somewhere. You, you can search to see, but these buildings are very rickety. I do have another way that we could search. Fire? Sort of. The cog. What about it? It, would, it has weaponry. We could destroy the surface. If there is a bunker here, it will be protected still. And it will expose its surface. Mm, but the difference of technology here, it could blow up the lower section. Could the sensors on the shuttle be enhanced in a way? They scan <clears> for <throat> structures, yes? Could it be used to scan for holes in the Can it? <laughs> Can you modify like under right small approach? underground areas? You know, Maybe. I, my assumption would be it might be possible. It will take, it, it it would take, take some time. time. And I might need extra parts for it. And I wouldn't be able to do it here. I would say you probably could. It's just going to take several hours for you to modify. I mean, if you want, I can just blow up this building, and then we can scan the other ones. Let's avoid blowing up. Well, I mean, the weapons, we paid money to have that. I can just rest and recover my energy. No, no, I mean, just let's wait to blow anything okay. up. Um... If, if I can get this to work, this would be a much more secured way to do it. Sure. And it does seem like it's something that is of importance to Banner. Yeah, so while Remy's doing that, does some of us want to investigate with Reiner because we're working as a group? Who has the best investigation? We're all disadvantage. <laughs> I wonder who has the best investigation. It's based on intelligence. Oh, fuck. But, yeah, he's busy right now. <laughs> Who has the second um, best investigation? <laughs> are you going to roll for checking? <laughs> there we go. Swift has the second best investigation. Good. So we're right. working as a team. I yeah, have so... circuitry, machinist. Um, you're be... you're helping out, Banner. Uh, I can help out Swift then. Sure. Yeah. yeah. yeah um, it's going to take you about three hours to modify. Oh, okay. I don't have to do a roll. No, I'm not going to make you have to do it, bro. You're basically routing more power to the sensors to be able to. That's an action. Ground. That's an action in combat. No, you're you're actually like I physically. Yeah, you're physically like hardwiring things. It's just not it. enough power. <laughs> <laughs> Pair of jumper cables uh, going from the cog to the shuttle. Yeah. <laughs> Banner. Banner running on a wheel. Yeah. <laughs> As you're looking around the site, <laughs> you start to get flashes of memories in your head. You think you once lived here. Interesting. During more peaceful times. Before shit exploded. I think Swift Fedor lived here. As I did. I've been worried as of late, Swift. Worried because... Not only am I beginning to remember things from the time of Fedor. Like this. But there are flashes of other much more... Stranger things. I don't know where they come from. 
and they begin to confuse me. You're not going to go crazy on us, are you? No. Okay. It's more like remembering another life. Which is kind of strange, because I already remembered another life. The one with Fedora. Maybe it was a life before Fedora. What would that have been? Was I something else before Warforged? I'm the original. I know that as much as true now that we've been here. These other ones were created after me. But... As a culmination of his power. Or an experiment. I don't know. But myself... How did he create the original? Maybe there is something to it. Maybe we can find something here. I don't know. But I found some things. Some things when I looked up information. Strange things that I didn't know about that were different than this. At least a little bit of information. We can talk about that later. Anyway. So, like I said, over time, more and more flashes. You, you, you remember certain, like faces. You can remember having possibly a family? Were they wood flavored? You, you believe there was once a community here of your people? Fascinating. And more time passes. Rimby finally gets the sensors up and running. Uh, time? It, it looks like. Uh, Doc and Back to the Future One. Putting <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> the wires together. <laughs> but he's also in the mech suit, so it's. Mech <laughs> <laughs> Doc. I am Iron Rimby. <laughs> this is Rimbus now. <laughs> like, um, all right. So they come back and are like, um. <clears throat> Uh, I, th I did it. Um, I, I, I did it. I did it. I was able to do it. And I pressed the button to activate the sensor. <laughs> yeah. By the way, the shuttle is a, right now like a nest of wires. Ding. Popcorn's done. <laughs> Going every which way. Mm -hmm. Oh, um, also, wait. In the process, can I... Um, can I... Uh, sweet rolls? Ah! <laughs> well... <laughs> what, what's, wor what's worst taste? Dirt. They're no longer... Dirt rolls. You no. got dirt rolls. Dirt rolls. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Beat. Because it tastes like dirt, but it's healthy too. <laughs> it's no longer wood flavor. It's beet flavored pellets in the shuttle. I'm okay with this. <laughs> I actually like the flavor of beets. But... I, I, I like beets, but I like pickled beets, so that's cheating, I think. So, I don't um... eat, so it's okay. <laughs> You get wood flavor and you like it. <laughs> uh, okay. So it scans. We we probably give cancer to any insect and small <laughs> mammal life that exists in that <laughs> radius. We're more important <laughs> but, than those bugs, okay? They don't matter. We they all instantly grow a tumor. Just instantly grow a tumor. <laughs> no, we, we create fallout um, giant ants and death claws. I also <laughs> want you to give me a technology roll. Oh, no. Good okay. thing it didn't count for that one. Yeah, I was being nice. Oh. 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 Oof. Wait a minute. What about that 10 thing? It's, it's, it's still, 11. It's still it's 11. 11. It's still beat it. Yeah. It's still beat. Like, if fumbles don't exist on uh, uh, skill rolls. It's just an 11. Yeah. Uh, unless Joe wants to be a dude. Are you, are you I don't like fumbles. Um, I, I love them. So you do get a reading and then a giant spark shoots out of the sensor array and it goes down. I did it. I did it. Fire time? I think um, 
I think you did get a reading now. I think um I just I can fix this. I, I swear I can fix this. Um I'm pretty sure I, I can fix this. Um granted, uh we did get some data. Uh it's probably not as much as we would have if um it's the cog. The cog is incompatible. Um yes, um uh, here's the reading. And I'll just give it to Banner. Like the information to Banner. There does seem to be a basement to it. Hmm. Well, I mean, guess that's where we can go next time. Yes. <laughs> Three hours. We could have been like, wreck your, live up to your name. <laughs> we, <could have. laughs> we really could have. Well, we had well, look, I, I assume that. during those three hours, Rekir not only discovered native life, challenged native life to a duel to the death, defeated native life, and then returned back to us. All right, do an attack roll. <laughs> By do native life, roll. you found some twirls. <laughs> twirls? <laughs> and they're very they're, dead now. They're no, very... no, that's my blast off attack. It's an uppercut. <laughs> Hadouken, yeah. you just like its head flies when we're off. Taking off. When we're taking off, we're going to see them in space. <laughs> <laughs> we basically them in space. <laughs> yes. Oh, we're hitting some turbulence. What was that? Sensors say it was organic matter. <laughs> oh, actually, sensors don't say anything. They're currently down. Well, they'll be fixed before then. <laughs> I, I mean, I. I I, I'm, I can literally fix them. So yeah, that would be machine, that would be ship maintenance, not technology, which is actually worse. <laughs> yeah, it, 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 you're gonna have to basically rebuild the sensors, but it's fine. Anyway, so yeah. But we will end it here cool. with uh, you guys finding the basement. Well, that there yeah. is the basement. There's an underground area that we want to check out. So we yeah. will start with uh, Blaze slash Swift. Oh, Any shout outs there we or go. Last there last we go. Uh, <laughs> you know, can catch me here every other week. Uh, we might be starting something new on Friday since my computer decided to crap out and I had to restart. I lost our seven days game. Yep. So. Big tears. Big mm -hmm. sad. Lightning slash. Hi, Lucia. I'm also here every other week unless it changes, and I'm also in other places. Like tomorrow, I'll be over on Funny's channel. I don't know what we're doing yet. No, I'm not going to be there. <laughs> hey, it depends on what we're doing. Don't say yeah. that. <laughs> well, I mean, I, okay, I might be there tomorrow. Normally, normally we stream on Mondays and just call it Cthulhu, where I am just the saltiest boy and no one talks to me. So you know. <laughs> You really are the little emo boy of the group. You're like, I, I, I don't. That's not what I've intended, but that's just kind of what happened. <laughs> uh, Wednesdays, uh, I'm with Tiv and Mads in her modern day D and D thing, which is streamed uh, now. Yeah, it's streamed now. It's most likely going to be on Tiv's channel because Mads' internet can't stream good enough, which is very sad. At all. Yeah, uh, and um, on Saturday. Um, it's earlier than most games. It's 1 p.m. Uh, Pacific time. I am playing Divinity Original Sin 2 with Tannis. Who, I mean, he's here in the Discord call. I don't know where he is on the stream. And then Tiv over here uh, and and also Will and Graham. They're already gritting confused and lost, so um, the meta gloves are probably going to come off. And it'll be like, hey, we should go here and do this. <laughs> uh, until we can kind of not be over. Murder. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Not murdered. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tim slash Rekier. Hi. Much like how I look right now, I could have been in bed this entire session and nothing would be different. It's uh, ouch. <laughs> you flew a ship. One... Pointlessly. <laughs> so the you cog does not need spotted, to be here right now. You spotted the things. Which the sensors would have done. No. You are useful and you are loved. <laughs> I accept the loved, but not useful. The sensors uh, might not have picked up on it with all the overgrowth of plants and stuff. Too natural. Very looking. true. Anyway, I occasionally stream. Uh, I don't know what's going on Monday. 
I've thrown out a bunch of suggestions, but I've gotten very little to no feedback. Uh, Wednesday, Mads, like, Lightning pretty much covers everything I do except for my personal stream, so. We yeah. spend too much time together. <laughs> right? Wow. I thought no, that it's it's but it's like it's it's bad when you're like what are you doing tomorrow? Well, blah 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 blah, and then like Josh, what what lightning said? What are you doing the day after that? What lightning said? Um, <laughs> I mean that's yeah, not all of it, but <laughs> so what you're saying is lightning needs to go last. No, I because then lightning say. would do the same thing. You're like what Josh said. Yeah, you I don't know. Like, what you're talking about, like yeah. lightning brings up a few things. You yeah, you know what? Like, we should write a script, and we yeah. what we'll do is we'll say in words in order, because that's not the most annoying way to introduce something. Right? Be like, hi. B. What? No, <laughs> you made it. Oh, I'm so confused. <laughs> Well, I'm thinking about continuing order. Unfunny one slash Rimby. Hi, everybody. I'm on a funny one. I'm I'm on a funny one. Well, you I guess are I'm the unfunny one. Mean, I am unfunny one. How you doing? Uh, a lot of you are here from the raid earlier, so you know about my channel and stuff. I don't really need to push all that. Uh, I started playing Sardew Valley first time. It's actually really kind of fun. Uh, I suck at it. Uh, first night, I passed out. Um... <laughs> Uh, everyone's, I, done I walked, everyone's done it i walked by my house and passed out because <laughs> i didn't know where i was um anyways uh but yeah it's starting to it's starting to kick off i guess because like the mine opened just recently and my plants are coming in and all that stuff so i'm like yay and i'm actually really starting to like it i'm actually tempted to stream more after this uh but i'm probably not gonna um so you can catch me playing that. I will, I think from now on, play that. Uh, one day a week, I'll have to pick out a day. It might be Saturday nights or something like that. Uh, another thing you can catch on normally Monday nights. Tomorrow's my birthday, so we're taking it. I'm taking it off. I'm trying to find something that's more chill. I do want to stream, but we'll see how that works out. There's stuff that we need to talk about. Um, <clears throat> other than that, you can catch me on normally on Mondays and play Call of Cthulhu with Lightning, Tiv, and another friend of ours, Joey. Uh, where we play the emo crew, everyone bickers, fights, and we're all scarred on the inside. And some That's on the fine. Outside. Mike's gonna mm -hmm. die pretty soon. I am so. the nicest one, thank you. <laughs> you are the nicest. It's actually a turn for you. Lightning's usually the one that's all like sympathetic and like tries to be friends with everybody, and you're usually like the shut up. So it's I, kind I, of I, feel, I feel a role. If the role isn't taken, I'll hop right in. To Love be me. fair. If you're interested, you can watch Tiv and I flirt because we do a lot of that on that stream. Um, we, like the only reason it hasn't happened on this stream is because we're brothers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, well, I am, you know, now, I am now a gnome playing a robot playing a gnome. So it's. I, I mean, mean, to be fair, we're technically not, not actually related. <laughs> it's true. Let the uh, I'm sorry. I probably changed your diapers, so my character's <laughs> seventy. Like you, he's That's a grown ass man. Human man. maturity, the maturity um, rate different. But other than that, I stream on Tuesdays, Thursdays, uh, Tuesdays and Fridays. I'm trying to incorporate Wednesdays as well. Um, and I'm on another stream. I play D and D, another gnome, which I guess I'm a fucking gnome guy. Yeah, now. you are. You're just um, a gnome. I love gnomes. Um, <laughs> Uh, I, on Thursdays, playing on uh, Delric's channel, uh, it's a darker campaign. So if you're gonna check that out, be warned: people die a lot. Everyone is dead. <sighs> Fucking Lily. Um. Fuck. Other than that, that's me. Hi. Hey. Thank you. I'm gonna go. To... <laughs> Tantus. Uh, Tantus and I have been Jacobin. This is my channel. So if you're here, this is my channel. Um, I stream pretty often most days. Uh, gaming usually is uh, Monday, Wednesday, Fridays. Uh, you know, if, if nothing comes up. Uh, it's kind of been up in the air with families being around all the time at home. So, you know, that kind of thing. So sometimes family stuff comes up. Otherwise, if you're looking for more RPGs, Tuesday we're off for both the RPGs. Uh, but we should be on for Thursday for D&D. &D and... 
maybe something special tomorrow. I'll see if I organize it or not uh, for May the 4th. We'll leave, leave that up in the air for now. I will announce it uh, probably during the day tomorrow on my Discord and Twitter if you're looking forward to seeing something like that. But if you remember what I did last year, it'll be similar to that. That was my hint. What I did last year, May the 4th. Uh -huh. uh, other than that, um, yeah, I'm, you know, pass it on to Joe to throw his yep. little shouts house out. I'm Joe. You'll find me here on Tansis' channel. I'm here on Thursdays for... Um... Children oh, my God. Yes, thank you. My brain died there for a second. Okay. Children and Death. And on Saturdays for discussing tabletop and Sundays, every other Sunday for my game here, Grinding Gears. And depending if uh, what goes on tomorrow, you might see me online tomorrow. Yeah, we'll see. But until then, until this Thursday, have a good week, everyone, and stay safe. Stay safe, stay healthy, everybody. Farewell. Bye.